Hey guys, Killbot27 here. I'm gonna be here for the last simulator tutorial, hopefully. Because I don't know how the arcade machine works either. I would love for someone to tell me that. But, um, we're gonna be getting the Sega Saturn after a year of doing nothing. First of all, you want Damon Tools. Damon Tools Lite. Don't buy it. That would be very, very stupid of you. Be stupid of everyone. Moving on. We need to get the SSF beta. Leave links for all these. Don't worry about it. So let's go ahead and grab that. And although it's beta, it works. Okay. Last, we don't need a Sega Master. We need Sega Saturn. All regions. Just in case you want to play your European games or whatever. I don't know what you're into. And for last, we're going to be using Cool Room to get games. I'm just going to use my House of the Dead file because that's easiest for me. Okay. Well, we can go ahead and get these out here. These are your bios. Well, now that we got those out, dumpster. And this is the emulator. Dumpster. Now we got all this. Now you need a new folder, and for whatever reason, you can't make a new folder with that. So I'm going to copy and paste and make BIOS. <laughs> okay. Now we're just going to stick those in there. Now we can take this, run it as, a, run it as an administrator, because it won't work either other way for whatever reason. Now we have this. Don't worry about anything else. We're just going to our options for now. Now, your Saturn BIOS are going to be in here. SS BIOS U. STV BIOS is going to be this one. CD drive, don't worry about that. We can't do that yet. I'm going to change this to America because I'm in America. And your controller, you need to go ahead and redefine this. Up, down, left, right. A, B, C, X, Y, Z left and right and start okay well that all looks about right okay well we can't do anything else now so we're gonna go ahead and open up Damon Tools run as an administrator again cause you're gonna have to be messing with our local disk okay now we're not gonna add images yet we're gonna make a drive and what this is gonna do this is gonna make it think that you have another CD drive and now we're gonna mount images so you need to locate where you downloaded your games mine's in here okay you need to open your ISO file not your Q file it doesn't matter what it's called it's gonna be your ISO file and now you need to mount it just right click mount and as soon as that's done, we can move on with our lives. So now we can get out of here. We can run this as an administrator again. Okay, we need to set this up. Yep. Now you're hopefully you don't hear this it's gonna be oh god that's loud okay you need to go into the options here CD drive and now you got your D DT soft see and now you see what's going on here we tricked it to think that we actually have the game so that's all good hardware open hardware closed just making sure we can exit this now I run it again and it should load the game right up Oh, that is music to my ears. Sega. Yeah, there we go. Well, that's basically it. Now you can just play your game. Well, I'll see you guys next time.